Massachusetts is a small state, yet one of the most densely populated areas in the U.S. So in keeping with the footprint and features of Massachusetts, TI Cold brought maximum density to minimal space for Corex Complete. This project is just well built. I mean, everything from the installation of major components like the mobile racking, down to the minute details of curbs. You just walk into this facility and you know you're standing in something solid. Quality craftsmanship, early adopters of innovative racking and refrigeration, fine-tuned implementation, nimble, adaptable. This facility will contribute to the supply chain industry for decades to come. A lot of folks who are not early adapters in the industry are, are they just want to stay away from mobile rack. It's the unknown. And um, really, once you take the initiative and spend some time to go look at mobile rack operations uh, and watch how they operate, you really get a much better sense of it. Corex Complete's 83,000 square foot facility hosts nearly 18,000 pallet positions, compared to less than 10,000 pallets with standard stationary racking. This presented an opportunity for the flex-based mobile racking in which we could not only drive the density, but we, all were, we were also able to provide them the selectivity and the flexibility in which they could really realize a sizable amount of pallets. You get 45% more pallets in the building. Um, the big benefit is that it's all single deep. It's much more efficient. We're 10 to 15% more uh, throughput in pallets per hour. It takes know-how to adapt to new ways of efficiency, from mobile racking installation to implementing natural gas refrigeration. Transcritical CO2 systems allow for precision accuracy and boast ultra-convertible operations, requiring a mere two-valve adjustment to transform a cooler to a freezer. Massachusetts, with its rocky earth and thick forests, meant an extreme undertaking for land clearing and blasting. Working within a tight 7.05 acres drastically escalated project complexity. Not one, but two off-site storage locations amplified logistic coordination, installing not one, but three underground storm basins, which multiplied construction steps, but was critical to maximize space on the site. Because of the retaining walls and the blasting and, and, and the truck lot and where things had to be situated, we also had to use uh, underground retention ponds. So that was another, that was another big uh, piece. Embedding specialty rail track into concrete floors necessitated a non-traditional pour and hours of calibration. There's only a certain amount of tolerance uh, in those rails, so when you, when you put the mud slab down, uh, you actually cast the rails into the mud slab and then lay the rebar over that to be able to put the finish slab down. You know, progress was threatened on multiple fronts, uh, mass DOT, inhibited operations on for several weeks. Project managers, one after another, contracted COVID. Uh, they were pulled off the sites, delays, unavailability of materials. And while we could easily have been pulled under by the tide, instead we prevailed, we sustained the budget and schedule. TI's project management team had to work quickly and creatively to route continued obstacles. The Arquil sprinkler system was integrated through the ceiling beams. We had to utilize beams in lieu of bar joists because of supply chain challenges. While designing the sprinkler system, we had to coordinate to get the beam penetrations prefabricated for the sprinkler pipes. Adaptability adds to sustainability. TI's functional design positions Corex to thrive within the facility scope, resulting in sustained environmental care, economic growth, and product opportunities due to the operational workability. Mobile racking ensures high density and therefore a decreased footprint. CO2's flexibility allows for simple adjustments in the freezer to adapt with operational needs and energy savings. M&M Carnot's transcritical CO2 system not only has a five times higher heat reclaim ratio, a level one rating on the global warming potential scale, but also frees up management thanks to fewer compliance requirements. Sustainable, simple, versatile. As the winner of the Massachusetts Economic Impact Award, 
TI Cold is honored to have worked with Corex to design and build a facility that is an asset to the greater community. Well, Mass Econ uh, sponsors the Massachusetts uh, Economic Impact Awards, and really what they're looking for is the project cost, what the benefit to the local community is, the number of jobs that are created, everything. We want to look at the total, total package. We were the Silver Award winner in Central Mass. Effecting great and small society alike, TI's project management team worked with the immediate community by rotating the building 180 degrees during the design phase in order to better conceal the building from the main highway, reduce noise levels, and create a more appealing frontage for the public. Projects like this aren't possible without working with the best, especially leaders in the field. Tony Leo was a pioneer in the cold storage industry. We were honored that his fingerprints were all over this building. From the office, to the dock, to the freezer, the fit and finish of Corex proves the quality of the craftsmanship and delivers an asset that not only adapts, but will outlast.